Almost daily covert operations and a multitude of surveillance trips to London played a key role in police dismantling a group of criminals who were swamping Bournemouth with cocaine. Dorset Police Operation Map came to its ultimate conclusion on Friday with six defendants jailed for a total of almost 40 years. The resulting court was the culmination of 18 months of work as an Albanian organised crime group operating in the county was brought to justice for the first time ever. Ari Zani, who is 29 years old, of Bournemouth, Andrew Doyle, of Christchurch, and Lawan Najim of Bournemouth, Magius Nonna of Birmingham, all pleaded guilty to conspiracy to supply and class A drugs. Agron Bendadius, 54, and Endri Kostreni were found guilty of the same offence following separate trials last year. Kostreni was also found guilty of being concerned in the supply of Class B drugs. Detective Chief Inspector Jamie Holford, Dorset Police, Senior Investigative Officer in the case, stated that the operation was right up there with the biggest in the force's history. Zani was presented by the prosecution as the head of the crime group at the top of the tree locally in respect of the dealing of several kilograms of cocaine. Police said Najim was his right-hand man. DCI Holford said, we used to follow them fairly regularly together. They would drive almost every day together and they would do frequent trips to North London. Costreni and Nonna were trusted sub-dealers who took part in the runs to London. DCR Holford said, It is known to police that Western Balkan crime groups tend to use people they know for trust reasons. The police investigation started in earnest in June 2020 and came to a head with a strike day of action in October. Bendadge was arrested in Highcliffe and police found around £40,000 in cash which they saw used in an exchange for a kilo block of cocaine. Doyle was a local resident buying cocaine in bulk and he was arrested nearby along with Najim who attempted to make off from a vehicle. Searches of the area led to Zani and Bendadge being detained. Further warrants were carried out at multiple Bournemouth addresses with cash and a substantial amount of cocaine seized. DCI Holford said it had taken a partnership approach from across the force to disrupt the criminals. He said it has been a significant number of people across the board, whether that is myself as a senior investigating officer or backroom staff like the analysis and people who are looking at communications data and surveillance travel. It also involved our operations team when we did the strike as well. On that day we had to use a number of officers from uniform and specialist uniformed assets. He described the covert efforts as almost painstaking with the close to daily observations of trips to the capital and criminal meetings in cafe. So the sentences are as follows. Zani was sentenced to eight years in prison. Bendaj received a seven-year jail term and Najim was jailed for six years. Kostreni 